Hello and welcome to 2 Minute Design. Today we're gonna create this glitch effect in Photoshop. Create a new 1920 by 1080 pixel document in Photoshop, set the color mode to RGB 8-bit, set the background content to black, and then click Create. Activate the horizontal type tool, set the text color to white using this box, choose a font that is bold and italic, click once on the canvas, and type the word GLITCH in all caps. Set the font size, and with the Move tool, align the text to the center of the canvas. In the Layers panel, right-click on the text layer and convert it to a smart object. Double-click on an empty area next to the layer name to open the layer styles, and under Advanced Blending, uncheck Green and Blue. Click OK, press Ctrl or Command J to duplicate the layer, Double click on the new layer, check green and blue, and uncheck red. Click OK, activate the move tool, hold down the shift key, and move the layer a little bit to the right. Great. Now select these two layers by holding down the shift key, right click, and convert them to a smart object. Activate the rectangular marquee tool, and create a rectangular selection just like that. Hold down the shift key and create another one, make it a little bit smaller. Another one there, and another one here. Make sure this layer is still activated, and then click this button to create a layer mask. So now the selected areas are hidden. Hit Ctrl or Command J to duplicate the layer, click on the mask of the new layer, and then hit Ctrl or Command I to invert it. Now with the Move tool, hold down Shift and move the layer a little bit. Again, hold down Shift and select both layers, right click, and convert to Smart Object. Go to Filter, Distort, Wave. Play with these settings or just copy these values, making sure the vertical scale is set to 1% and click OK. Ctrl or Command J to duplicate the layer, then go to Filter, Pixelate, Mezzotint. I'll use Short Lines and click OK. In the Layers panel, activate the bottom Smart Object, then go to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur. Set the angle to 0, and the distance as you want, and click OK. For the last time, select both layers and convert them to a smart object. Control or Command J to duplicate. Go to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur again. Use the same settings, and click OK. Finally, in the Layers panel, with this layer still activated, set its Blend Mode to Multiply. And that's how you create a glitch effect in Photoshop. Thanks for watching, guys.